Okay, let's continue. If you're watching later on YouTube, hope you're enjoying. Thanks for clicking. This is next. Um, so I've, I've changed the RGB output to full. Because I, I did remember uh, just that being mentioned. And I don't know. Like, I think it, I think it's fine. I think maybe my, my eyes are just adjusting to it, but... Or it's interesting because it was on automatic and automatic was setting it to limited, so I wonder why. Anyway, uh, now I'm gonna go drop off this weapon, like I said, and uh, store the blade that I have. But I think I, I just keep... the traveler's sword thing, I just keep saying I'm gonna do it and I don't do it, so I might do it quickly. It's not too much of a pain. It's a bit of messing around, yes, but let's open up with that. And then I guess we, uh, we head to the Shrine of Resurrection. Or I can go to Tarrytown as well, because that quest should be in its home stretch as well, so. We got some filler content that we can do. I'm gonna be playing for a while tonight, so let's, uh, let's take advantage of that. We'll see if anyone sees a difference, but... It did feel like uh, my menu was a bit more saturated when I swapped to full mode, but maybe that's the idea. Did I drop anything? No. Just making sure. Maybe I should go to Tarrytown first because that is closer. Yeah, let's go resolve Tarrytown. Tarrytown's closer. Dropping off the weapon can happen after Tarrytown. Because then we don't have to go back to Akala for a while. It's okay. We'll be fine. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Pick up the horse uh, on the stable to the left.
can't wait to see if anything happens now. Ah, <laughs> oh, that, that last bit was a bit of a roller coaster of emotions with... Oh, just completing that base and then the glitchy stuff, man. It's great. Well, they're already knocked out. I need to purchase more arrows from Beetle. Hey. <laughs> yeah, I'll take a hasty elixir. It's a good one. So uh, let's go resolve Tarrytown. We're pretty much done. I think the the wedding is the last bit of it, so. May as well. Oh, they're up again. saying anything about those the storm. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, which way is easier to go to Tara Town? This way. I think after this it's just minor quests left. I don't think there's any major ones. Yeah. So I'll leave them if there's filler content that I need to do before Tears launches. I'll do quests. Thank you. 
Whereas oh, there you are. Oh, you found the Zora. Thank you. Really, he and I talked earlier and said that he literally was a priest before he retired. You can't get more priest like than that. And his name is Capson, so I have no objections there. He really is amazing. It really is amazing that you were able to find someone priest like who also had an acceptable name. Well, next is. Of course, I have to invite guests. Guests? I'm talking about my boss, Bolson, and my subordinate, Carson. However, I've got to prepare the ceremony. Could you invite them? Where are they? Hatino Village. I'm going to Hatino, so that's, that's perfect. This worked out great, because I'm going to Hatino to drop off the, uh... Yeah, Mifa's weapon. So this will this will do. Opponent, stop! What are you do What are you doing? Turn it. I can't turn around in there. Hey, what'd you say? Meat for power. Traveling chef. Yeah, I'll take those. These these ones I'll definitely take. Uh. Oh. <laughs> Alright, let's go give that invite. Oh yeah, before I do, since I'm here... Good here. Damn it. It's okay. And here. Hey, come here again. Let me see your clothes. The wild. Oh. I'll, I'll do this now since I'm here. I'm not wearing it. Oh. Some sense in yeah, bonus when you wear them. Ferocious Clora, we need claws. Ooh. See, now I know what to go for, because that's the reason I wanted it, is just to know. Mm. I think I need claws.
Right, so I need... Claws from Ferocious and Dinral. Well, Dinral's fine. Ferocious and Nadra. Fangs, ugh, fangs from all of them. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I mean the dragon farming is gonna be uh, it's gonna be interesting, but. No, I know. This is why I have been collecting honey for the entirety of this playthrough. Every time I go past Satino, that honey spot, I have to. It was in preparation for upgrading the gear. So many trips back and forth. It's okay, this is just the calm before uh, getting to the more serious content. This is going to be like 20, 30 minutes of traveling. I'm sorry. Huh. No fast travel, but hey. We got to see a wedding.
Something I want to look at. Playtime with Kotla. I haven't done that. Let's see. Death Mountain Secret. So I just need to have a royal god thing. Okay. I mean, some of these might be worth just doing. We'll see how much time we have at the end. Time with Kotla was the hide and seek one. Yeah. I think I just ran out of time because I just got it way too late. I wonder if the ingredients have grown back. Let's see. It would appear that they have. Alright. This is always worth stopping and grabbing everything from here. It's, it's just so good. It's these shrooms, the radishes, it's just everything here. I think this is probably one of the best uh, ingredient spots in the game. I don't think all the ingredients have respawned. Oh no, here we go. I want that bow. your bow.
think that should do. Ooh, that was close. As long as I got a couple big hearty uh, radishes. Ignore me. Is our friend Tilt here? No, Tilt's not here this time. Nearly there. I think after the wedding, I'll just start doing the next stuff. Get the traveler's sword and do this trip one more time. <laughs> and then we go to the, uh, the plateau to start the uh, Ballad of the Champions. There was a quest here that referred to a cave, and I should probably do it. It's not that far from here. Was the clue? Hang on. The little twin steps over the little river. My cave rests at above that river's source. It's like there. You would think, anyway. Alright, I'm going to look there. Hip. Hup. 
Especially since we have ravioli power now, so. I think I can already see it, to be honest. It's like over there. That's the one. Toasty hearted. Okay, yeah, I mean, basic kill. I wouldn't want to take truffles out of a cave that's... <laughs> yeah, okay. Well. That's fine. Alright, let's get out of here. I figured whilst I was in the area, I'll get this quest. Probably gonna need more honey, just based on the upgrades. Yeah. Hey, the honey's back already. These two shrooms. Okay, one shroom. I wonder if there's a better spot to get traveler swords. Hang on. I'm looking it up. Okay. The Hylia River's actually the closest one. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. 
I guess I have my answer. It's, that's, I just have to suck it up and make the trip. Jeez, <laughs> this, that hard freeze. Oh good, they're here. Have a wedding invite. Oh my, aren't you perky? Well then, wait, what? Oh. Hudson's getting married and now he wants me to attend the wedding? Wow, good on him. Okie do, I'm in. Wedding time, baby. Not like there's anything to do here anyway. Well, I guess I'll get packed and head to Hudson's place. Please. Mm -hmm. Heh, this'll be fun. Okie do. Oh. Carson, we're heading out. Finally, we've been waiting for this day. What am I doing? Inventory. So, that weapon has been laid to rest. Oh shit, I can't. This is a bow spot. That's kind of annoying. Okay, so I guess I have to hang on to the sword and just make sure I don't mess up. One thing I should do since I'm here, because I mean, I don't want to mess up later. Like, let's say I run quests. I'm going to need cold resist, I would imagine, again. So I'm going to, uh, I'm going to go get sun shrooms since we're here. Where are you, Sunshroom?
I mean, if I got like 10 or so, it's worth the trip. Oh, yeah, there's Iron Shroom here as well. This is the other reason this is worth it. What? Let's get it. I was sneaking. time. Seeing if there's any other quests I didn't pick up, but I think this aside from the kid who wants to see weapons, I feel like I'm on top of this area. I just can't believe how rare this traveler's sword is, I just don't see it anywhere. I know of one location where it is. Alright, let's go. Pana, please, go. There's no speed limits here, just go. Hoping whatever weapon the kid asks for isn't that difficult after this one. But I guess I'm just gonna hang on to this Yiga weapon until he asks for it, because he does. So I have the hard weapon out of the way, in theory. I just need to go to the effort of getting this this traveler's sword and bringing it. Yeah. <laughs> 
trying to think what other preparation I should do. I mean, weapon. Uh, I mean, I'm short one weapon, but it should be okay. I think I'll just steal, like, some clubs from some style weapons or, uh, style moblins or something. Style weapons. I don't remember what you get a, as a reward for this wedding thing either. I'm just sitting here trying to think, wait, what? What do you even get for this? <laughs> I don't remember. This is probably the first legitimate Blood Moon we've seen in a long time as well. It's just, I don't know, my game's in a state of, uh... It's kind of corrupted at this point. I think, I think it is. The blood moons just seem to happen really abruptly. The blood moon rises once again. This one is a legit one, because we heard the music. In the build up. Before I go to... I'm just trying to think. Is it easier to go to Zora's Domain, get the sword, or go Akala, attend the wedding, then get the sword? Yeah. I think it's probably better to get the sword first. Huh. <laughs> Come on. Don't do that. Yeah. Am I gonna run into my friend Tilt? Let's see. It's that tree over there. Tilt is not here. Huh. Oh, that was lucky. Yeah. Huh. I don't know how that happened yeah. before. Ah. Uh. Isn't that the same travel that I just ran into 
15 seconds ago. I wish there was a better way to cross this. If only it wasn't enemy infested, it would be nice and straightforward. Sorry, this is the most interesting thing. The travel between places, ugh, I know. But such is the challenge, just not fast traveling. Dead. Okay, here we go. So, get off a pona here. And let's go fetch the st stupid sword. just here. Oh good, it's, it's the glitch, it's the glitch moon again. It's like daytime and the blood moon's going off. And me jumping is preventing it. I've done something to make to make this game just do this. Got it. <laughs> the blood moon rises once again. Oh, just respawn the sword. Go grab your leap. Get me out of here. Go 
it, really. I don't have another one. Let's just meet up with a pona. Now I can attend this wedding. Oh man. The thing is, even after this, I still have to head south to get to the plateau anyway, so it's like almost the same travel distance. I may as well go drop off the sword. <laughs> It's going to be a thing. I probably should have talked to Beetle there just to get more arrows, but I can do it on the way back. Finally, it's wedding time. Everyone's here, right? <laughs> oh. You extended my invitation for me, thank you. Now then, Carson and the boss are waiting for things to begin. Shall we begin? Yes. Understood. Then let's... I mean, that's up to you. He asked me if we should begin. 
That's, that's your wedding, dude. <laughs> Silence, please, everyone. We shall now begin. We are gathered here today to join Hudson and Ronson in matrimony. Hudson, for the eyes of the witnesses and before those of the goddess Hylia, do you take Ronson to be your wife and uh, to have and to hold in good times and in bad? I do. Excellent. And Ronson, before the eyes of the, these witnesses and before those of the goddess Hylia, do you take Hudson as your lawfully wedded husband in sickness and his health? And do you vow to name your children in accordance with the Bolson Construction Naming Guidelines? Wait a moment. Those vows are not traditional by anyone's standards. What makes you say that? They're as traditional as it gets. I don't think she means traditional in that sense of the word. A vow of undying tradition. And a vow of guidelines compliance. I'll take that vow. Think of future generations. Well, those are the guidelines, I do. Excellent. And so, dearly beloved, please help me in greeting this newly married couple. I wish this new couple nothing but the utmost happiness as they set out on this journey of mar uh, marital bl bliss. <laughs> oh. It's you. Thank you for attending the ceremony. Are you crying? What? No, just something in my eye. And now Tarrytown looks like a real town at long last. This was all possible because of you. I can't thank you enough for all the hard work you did. Alright, this is for you. Three diamonds. These were found inside boulders we smashed. Take... Just three diamonds. Alright, we're done here. That's the longest quest. <laughs> it just spans pretty much the entirety of the game. Rivali's Gale is now ready. How much money do I have? I should probably take advantage of the fact that I'm in a color. I know this is another detour, but I'm I I'm in the region, it's just here. Makes sense to come here. I mean, hey, Celix is a final tech those. Honestly, at this point, I may as well. these these are all good ingredients. I'd need to buy them.
good money. I think that's it. I mean, okay, I have a lot of these. Yay! That'll do it. Let's go. I wanted my bows to be uh, good again. Oh. <laughs> the, that stupid rock didn't let me escape. Okay, I got the parry. Dude, why can't the horse just hop over that, honestly? It's such a dumb thing to stop for. journey south. Get ready for uh, the Great Plateau. is going on? <laughs> Dude, there's something wrong with my game. It's tilt. <laughs> I've, I've done something to my game. There's no way this is not like corrupted. This is a separate, a separate uh, traveler in a separate area. It's, it's the same problem. What the fuck? <laughs> I've definitely done something to my game. This is not normal. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, this is incredible. 
So, uh, yeah, I, I don't know what to say. <laughs> I don't know what to say anymore. Something is wrong with my save file, clearly, because it's... <laughs> That's better than the T-pose. I'm gonna... Every time I see... A traveler with a horse standing there on the side of the road, I'm gonna see... I think I thought it was because the horse caused it because it was too uh, close to the NPC but no this confirms that, that something's wrong because that horse was was just enough uh, of a distance away that it wouldn't cause that Safe file just might be slowly but surely dying. <laughs> just the world around it is getting more and more corrupted. Seems to only happen at night time, but we'll see. Paying attention to every traveler I come across now. <laughs> It's just that specific traveler, and it's just that that's traveler. I should have paid attention to the name of the traveler. I want to. I want to know what's going on. 
Whether this is just a specific traveler or this is genuinely just... It's just messed up at this point. Forest. Let's see if it's recovered. Looks like it has. I should mark the location of the big radishes so then I'm not messing around. But I guess if I do this enough, I'll know. Even if I don't get the big ones, it's fine. I don't see the big ones. Here we go. Yeah, there it is. Ah, uh, that'll do. Huh? Yeah. Every time I'm here, I'll just collect more. I think it's only a nighttime thing because they don't stop and hang out during the day, so that might be why. But I don't know. I'm gonna watch over this later and try to figure out what is going on. Hey, Colin, how are you? Good morning. Yeah, so, uh... New glitch has dropped. <laughs> yeah. It's a good one. Yeah. What happened? Picture's worth a thousand words. But not, not just once. I've ran into travel, like, it, it, it looks like my travelers have been corrupted to the point where at nighttime they're all doing that, if they have a horse next to them, and they're camped. Because I've run into it a second time, just before. I didn't do anything! <laughs> I was just... Ugh. I, I made it, I, I used the, the Twitch moments thing, so it'll appear on the channel. 
later. If it's not already there, but... It's just... I was just traveling on horseback, and then I noticed in the corner of my eye, hmm, that horse seems to be really close to the dude camping. So I stopped, I got off the horse, and he was like that. And then, what's even better is he just, he just walks sideways. Like, it's not like he's stuck, no, it's... His character's been rotated, so he he walks on an angle like that. Yeah. Don't, I'm sure I'm sure we'll come across it again because it's happened a second time. So now it's not a one off it's not a one off thing. Like I've I've done something to corrupt my file. Like it's just getting worse and worse. Yeah. I think the best thing about it is just the facial expression that NPC has. It was just... It was making me laugh so much just because it was just a smug look. Just a deal with it nerd kind of face. Yeah, I've had a, I've had a lazy day because I, I was up late hanging out with a friend, so I slept in. I'm paying attention to every single traveler on the side of the road now. I really do hope it happens a third time. <laughs> I'm going to pay attention to the name of the traveler. It's either a case of maybe that one traveler is glitched or all of them are doing that now. I don't know. It's almost night time, so we'll see. divine base that I do are uh, the remaining ones so they're all done now I'm just going to I'm going to Hatino to deliver a sword that the kid wanted yeah I mean I, I beat I beat the one that I didn't do yesterday so I did that quickly and then uh, the Zora's the main one it was quick because it just it's, it's the easiest one so, they were back to back. Yeah. But I figured get some extra time in because, uh, yeah, yeah, I didn't stream as much yesterday. Well, now it's uh, Champion's Ballad, which is, yeah, that's its own uh, ordeal, so. Huh. It's DLC time. Yeah. I'm just doing this sword thing and then I'm going to head to uh, the sp the spot where you start it, so. Yeah. We'll see how that goes. Yeah. <laughs> Honey hasn't respawned yet. Okay, keep going. Yeah.
I have leftover meat and cheese, so I'm gonna get some of it later. Midnight sack. Well, it's only 9 p.m. Maybe a bit later. That one uh hey. What is it, buddy? What what did you find? Follow me. The shrine. No, what did you find, kid? Devil statue. This. Are you talking about the statue? Are you talking to that statue? Well, wow. I'm talking to statues. Weird. See you. <laughs> That's it. You're up to 84 Koroks. You've never gotten so many before. Good. good. Do you have a number you're going for? Are you going to go for all 900 or just... Because I think the number before you have all upgrades is like 440. So if you find 440, that's all upgrades available. And anything beyond that is just, well, yeah. Where's the kid? You've seen this one. Where is this kid? They're running around town. Isn't that the Traveler's Sword? Nice, nice. Let me see. Go ahead. Finally. Yeah, give the sword to the kid. Wow. The real thing is really the real deal. Thanks. Here's my token of thanks. Okay. Don't be so modest. Fire rod. Okay. Um. See ya. <laughs> uh, fire rod. Okay, so uh, where are the ruins? Wherever there's a burnt down town. We'll try to go for the 440. Good luck. I mean, there's certain areas where there's just a lot of them. But it's, it's not too bad. I won't worry about the fire rod too much right now, but... Maybe I can look it up. Let's see. Fire Rod. There's a few locations. Let's see. Southwest near the big tree, hang on. Halfway between Lake Hylia and 
dueling picks. Middle portion of data. Okay, so there's there's one here. Um, southwest of the Rita Earth Shrine. I don't know what. Hang on, I'm gonna see. I mean, if that's the closest, that's not too bad. All right, I'll go get it. It's not that far away. <laughs> Plus, I, I to be honest, I'm giving it more time to run into travelers at night, so there's that. Because when I start doing the uh, ballad thing, it's it's not going to happen since we're on the Great Plateau. I'm glad that stupid traveler sword thing is done. A screenshot of a tilted dude that has to be one of my favorites now. I think at the, yeah, I was saying this earlier, but at this point, I think I have to just compile all these clips together because this is just a lot of a lot of little moments here and there. It's enough. I've had a lot of stuff happen to me playing this. Don't break the new game; it'll probably happen. It's not like I'm trying to do it; <laughs> it just happens. <laughs> In fact, earlier as well, I was just, I was talking about just how before I started streaming, the stuff never happened to me, and it's only when I started streaming that just for some reason I gained a glitch passive and I just break whatever game I play. And then, quite literally, as I said that, I was walking into an invisible wall. I was like, "Wait, why can't I move?" And then suddenly, these crates appear in front of me. Comedic timing. The, the crates were invisible for a good five seconds, ten seconds. So, according to the thing, it's... Okay, where those three are on that hill, if I go over that hill... 
that's why there'll be a fire one. Let's just get off here. And then maybe we'll run into tilt. So here, apparently. Somewhere here. But you know what? I think I remember. See ya. There you are. Thank you. Wait, that's a meteor rod. Is there a difference? This is not the this is not the weapon. <laughs> There's a difference. I wanted a, a fire rod, it dropped a meteor rod, which is the rarer one, but like <laughs> it didn't want this. I don't know if this is accepted. Did it really give me the rare item so then I wouldn't complete- I- ah. Uh. Hang on. It's not gonna get accepted, is it? That's <laughs> so annoying. Okay, glitch passive, can you please give me a blood moon? Also, what the fuck? That just looked weird. Yeah, okay. Can I have a blood moon, please? Blood moon? Blood moon? Yeah, I, I want one now, so it respawns that thing. And I get another, another chance of getting a fire rod. I have a meteor rod now, which it's not what I wanted. What's the other location? Hyrule Field and the Great Forest. Where's the Great Hyrule Forest?
Ah, uh, apparently there's one over there. Yeah, it's too far away. Alright, let's just start the ballad thing. It's fine. Unless there's a blood moon pretty much now, that's just not worth it. No, that's that's fine. Don't worry about that. That's that's completely normal. I'm kind of purposely going around here. Okay, this looks like a good spot. See ya, Pona. We'll, we'll be back at some point. Perfect. Alright, well, it's time to get this shit started. Detail was fun. So we're always stopped to cook, but eh. We'll be fine. That's not the, the original thing. Hang on. This is the original thing. Okay. Well, here we go. Yeah. Take hold of the provided weapon and begin the trial. The weapon sash is full. Of course it is. Well...
It's a good one as well. Look, look at how... I didn't want the meteor rods. <laughs> anyway, it's fine. I can't put it down. I am Amaz Kashia. I now address the one who wishes to master a divine beast. To undertake this task requires unwavering dedication. That weapon defeats foes with one hit, however the reverse is also true, as the wielder can fall to a single strike. You can use this weapon's ability only twice within a set period of time when it's glowing. When enough time passes, the weapon will gain its power along with its sheen. At the four marked locations within the Great Plateau. Defeat all the monsters present to prove your power. If you're not up to the challenge, leave this plateau. The weapon will return here and the trial will end. This is where the death count goes up. One straight ahead, so let's go straight ahead. for the bats to come charge me. Okay, at any rate, it doesn't matter. Got it. Okay, move back. No. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh. I don't know what I walked into. It's fine, it's fine, let it go, let it go. Okay, it's back. I'm being careful. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, go for the one with the spear first. <laughs> I need to get the spear one first. I didn't realize it had a spear. I would have gone for it first. It's so annoying because they can just stab you so quickly. Okay. Worked. 
I need to get rid of those bats first. I need to lure them here. Oh shit! The spikes. <laughs> ah, that was bad. Environmental death. Oh, put me here. That's interesting. Oh, there's so much of a wind up on this one. Not Magnesis. There we go. Careful. The bats count, so I need to get rid of these bats. Oh my god, they're so annoying. Like, I, I can't see where they're coming from. I'm trying to get rid of them. I might just shoot a bomb arrow in their direction, because... They're the biggest pain in the ass. Okay. I'm getting rid of these bats. Fuck are they? Got him. Oh, come on. Wow, they are being. They are being really dickheadish about this. Okay, they're gone now.
cost me enough time. Oh, there's no ravioli power here. Ravioli, ravioli, give me the formioli. <laughs> yeah, no, that's not useful at all. Okay. Yo, Wakaita! Yeah, I mean... Collected soul. Careful. I want to roll out these spike balls so then they don't fuck me up. Wait, where'd it go? Okay, you know what? Can I just look at this for a minute? Oh no, they've put anti-cheese measures here. Careful. Okay. Putting the spikies away. So there's a path forward. I got scared there. Can't I just do... That's better. Perfect. As long as it doesn't get knocked away, I don't think it will. No! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try and grab it this way. Hopefully it'll work. Move the tick quickly. Yeah, 
Elemental. Oh, I kinda got the Hylian Shield. This thing? Yeah, I'll get it at some point. Right, this is the big one. Don't care about the big one now. Resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. Okay, that's the same thing. That's number 121. It's weird that it doesn't count it as a shrine. The shrine counter still remains at 120. It bothers me. That's a that's a strange choice. Okay, first trial done. Next one isn't there's a few. Okay, here's the thing. I think cold resist I should be able to do it. It's alright. Well, yeah, I mean, if the things count. It looks like there's one in the mountains, so I'm gonna have to use cold resist. Hopefully it'll work. This weapon is interesting, but you can't hang on to it. Oh yeah, does this count as a... hang on. Plus I still have it. Yeah, it does. Wow, imagine if I didn't have that. Okay. I haven't saved in a while, let me save. I should be taking photos of anything now because it's DLC. It's here, right? Straight ahead. Dead. <laughs> it's fun to do that. What? Excuse me, why is that rolling?
Oh shit, it's a golden one. Nice, nice work. Nice work, dickhead. This one's gonna suck because they're lizards. going well, as long as they're not spitting on me. I thought this was going to be more of a pain in the ass because of the spitting. Let's, I need to get rid of the golden one. Ooh, fire. I'll take those. I mean, it's nice that I got the rewards from killing them as well. Rubies, their fire arrows, this is great. Love it. I blame the bats. The last one was just, I was just constantly afraid of those bats sweeping in. the cold resist stuff will work <laughs> doesn't i guess i have to wear the clothing just at the very least the vest but the cold resist should hopefully work yeah, it's interesting because these ones seem to be uh anti-cheese They don't seem to have... They don't seem to have, uh, an advantage. Other ones you can clearly do... Ooh. You can clearly go over them.
please. I, I have played Mario's, Mario games my entire life. <laughs> that did not stress me out in the slightest. This, on the other hand, might. Oh, I can cut the I can cut the rope here. There we go. That one's easy. And this is just. There we go. Easy. Shit. This is now Crash Bandicoot. Just relax. I've also played Crash Bandicoot games, so... Please, this was fun. Okay, 122. Whilst this load screen's happening, I'm getting water out of the fridge, so hopefully I should be back quickly. How unexpected to see a traveler on this solitary plateau. Ooh. And we made again, hmm? Not to be rude, but you don't look so well. <laughs> Much like this plateau, you're looking a mighty, a might dire. Oh, I apologize. Perhaps it's not my place to say as much. I understand more than most the burden of travel. As for me, I came to this spot to pursue an ancient song about a hero at this very plateau. Oh. I can't shake the feeling that we were destined to meet here. In any case, would you like to hear my song? Oh. Okay. Uh. The flames crawl, the waters rise. Lightning strikes, the wind sighs. A base beyond the divine floor awaits a hero forevermore. Let not the sound Leave horses riled. Breathe in the breath of the wild. <laughs> Title drop. <sighs> Curious indeed. As it were, I perused my teacher's old notes and found that song there. Hmm, what sort of sound could alarm a horse so effectively? Kabam, kapow, rumble, rumble. Honestly, I haven't a clue. It certainly helps to visit locations that inspire the song. Yes, it helped open my eyes to inspiration. These notes had other interesting so songs too. I plan to visit those locations too. Yeah, I think we have to go on a tour. I mean, it's nice of it to... to put this stuff just here. Okay, uh... 
<laughs> We're going on a trip. Die it. Die it. <laughs> I know where this is going. I, I swear I will I will find Australian earworms and plant them. You thought the wiggles were bad? No, no, no. There's much worse out there. Here. Ooh, there's horses now. You're dead! Oh shit, I needed that. I needed that. Oh, that's bad. You're dead! Got a fine one for you? What? I got plenty. I mean, if you want a 90s earworm, I got a 90s earworm. Not specific to Australia. Dispose of the horse. Oh shit! It's okay, it's okay. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. I love doing that, it's fun. What is it? Okay. Hold on. I'll find it. But just just be warned. Try and listen to the whole try and listen to the whole thing. <laughs> okay. Wait, how long? I don't know how long it is, but it's a joke. <laughs> Clearly. Good luck. I want to pick up the stuff they dropped. I'll have a look around. I guess I can take my time. Yeah, that's what we want. That shit. Give me the good shit. Stop time that. Where are the other monster guts I, I want? You know what? If I do this, I bet if I, I can find it. Alright, it doesn't matter. Dead. 
before the alarm was sounded. Oh shit, that was close. Good luck, good luck not having that song stuck in your head now. It's catchy, yeah. There's a few songs like that from the 90s. There's also that song centerfold where like in the middle of it is like na 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 La 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 hey dude <laughs> Earworms Oh shit Ah uh ha -huh. But I mean shouldn't the one shot apply? Guess we'll see huh? Eh? Okay, first of all, peel us so we don't get shot. What? Because I took two more sweat. Huh? How how did I die? Because I took more than one swing. I don't know. Uh, not sure why I why I die. No idea why I died. Okay. Um, now I have an opportunity to. I mean, I don't know how damaged it is. I guess that's the thing. Is like I should just do that. Oh, there you go. Extra guard. Excellent.
Apparently it's not over. Another one there. Okay, careful. I just gotta make sure I have photos of these things. Never know. Okay. That is strange. I gotta be careful here as well because, uh, yeah, if I drown, then I, I die. Interesting. What am I missing here? drop, so I guess we're safe. Ah, here it is. Well, whatever this is. Okay, it's not the key. That's fine. Yay. <laughs> Nearly there. Oof. timing. <laughs> I just have to go for it. Oh, I have to start the whole thing again. That's kind of annoying. No, okay, it's fine. Safe progress, thankfully. Fuck. 
Oh, that messed me up. I was trying to jump down immediately, but Link decided to grab onto the wall. threat done. their paces. So this was like an extra major test of strength. Ah, see that one? I lost its parts. It's a fun one. One more to go! Your triumph over the test of strengths averts a prophecy of ruin. Yeah, yeah. One more. The swan to the mountains now. Not allowed to equip it. Um, guess what? We're okay. Just do this. There we go. Careful. Okay. I don't want to hurt myself. Um, we need Elixir. Do two just in case. I wish you could hang on to this weapon. It'd be cool to run around the rest of the game like this. Yep. 
just one-shotting everything. You know, one thing I, I learned yesterday from the cheese thing is, particularly brie, apparently you're supposed to, when you have it fridge, you're supposed to leave it out for like 40 minutes before you should eat it, because then it activates the flavor better. And I did that yesterday, and yeah, it's, it's legit. Yeah, I didn't know that, but it's a thing. Supposedly when it's cold, it, like, mutes it. Ooh, that almost got me. careful. That's a lot of ice bats. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> I was trying to avoid that. That shouldn't be allowed. I hate that so much. The dead body can kill you. Not taking that risk again. Ooh, that was close. Another 200 times. 
I'm not- I'm not doing anything. I'm just gonna try my best to get through everything. What the- Diamond. Yeah, it's probably a better idea than using an explosion. This is gonna suck. Come here. Come here, ugly. left. This is a blizzard rod, isn't it? What is it? Yeah, blizzard rod. Okay. What's left? Golden one. That makes sense. Apparently, the, the jelly don't count. That's interesting. They don't count as uh, enemies to have to take down. Okay. Final one. And then it'll be all the shrines done with three hearts. Oh boy. This probably will, though, to identify dangers. So good. Huh. 
Why are they being annoying? Oh shit. Got it. Lucky. That's it. Wait. I mean, that's a common thread in this game. It's just being more annoying than a challenge. I could have just run past them. I just didn't want to risk getting sniped. I didn't know what was around the corner, so... Better safe than sorry. One twenty-four. That's it. That's every single shrine in the game done. Finally. <laughs> We're back to normal now. You've done well to conquer the trials laid before you. You are Hyrule's beacon of hope. But your trials have only just begun. The divine weapon shall lead you. So, you know, in case you missed the, the beasts, they, they return. Now that you've proven your power, a new journey awaits. Go to the four locations that will be revealed to you and reach for greater heights than before. Gotta do it again. Uh huh. So now we get uh, like an increased version of uh, the the power of each spirit. It's to power up your abilities. So. Weapon's sadly gone now, but that's all right. I mean, the closest one to go to is this one. I mean, I guess I should get the annoying one out of the way first, huh?
So, okay, we need to make a couple of these. Did it again. Meets man. This happened earlier, it just seemed to vanish and then would appear out of nowhere. It's, it was so weird, there's no sign of him and then he just appears. Oh, there you are. Have some meat. <laughs> oh. Mm. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> I got some meat. Uh, I just looked at the, the VOD time. Okay, I'm taking another intermission. I'm getting my my snacks. But when we return, gonna now head to each of these locations and do the thing. So, should be fun. But if you're watching later on YouTube, this is where I say bye, YouTube. <laughs> you're used to it by now. Uh, yeah, but consider doing any of that algorithm stuff if you want to support the channel and uh yeah see ya <laughs>